If you're a fan of me on social media, you know one of the things I like to point out a lot of times when I see it is class. And recently, we got a quote from Mahershal Ali, our new daywalker, about the Blade series and the former incarnation of the character. And I gotta say, this guy has class. Let's take a couple minutes to break down the story. But before we dive in though, make sure you hit that like and subscribe button and ring the bell for all the updates. Also, the huge giveaway. We got a PlayStation 5 to give away at 25,000 subscribers. All you need to do to get in on the giveaway is be a subscriber and leave us a comment. Also, while you're at it, check out that free week of Skillshare down below. It's the perfect way to develop all of your superhero skills for the never-ending war on crime, all by not diving too deep into your pocket. Plus, it really does help the channel, so we really appreciate it. Well, if you guys remember, back when we first heard that Blade might be getting a reboot in the MCU, there were quite a few fans that actually wanted to see Wesley Snipes return to the role. There were even some early rumor reports that the actor was in talks with Marvel Studios to return to the character, but that never manifested. Now, we don't really know how close this came to happening, but we do know that Oscar award winning actor Mahershala Ali is now set to take over the role and be the new Blade in the MCU. Now, like I said in the intro, I love when an actor has some class. This isn't something you can teach somebody. You either have it or you don't. And clearly, Mahershala Ali has it because he had some really great things to say about the role and his predecessor. Let's check it out. You know, what I look forward to is earning it. I look forward to earning, you know, there's an anticipation for it. There's an excitement for it that he owns that Mr. Snipes owns. And so, in filling his shoes, I'm just looking to earn my place in this, and I'm excited to get going and do the work. Now, this is a tiny spoiler, but if you've seen The Eternals, you know you actually hear his voice in the post credit scene of the film. This is when Dane Whitman picks up the Ebony Blade. Now, this might be a hint to a Blade Black Knight team up down the road, but it's not confirmation, but we do know the character not only exists in the MCU, but if he showed up at Dane Whitman's house, he's actually active. So this leaves me with a ton of questions about how Blade will be developed and how he will first be introduced into the Marvel Universe. Now, I suspect that Daywalker might show up in like Moon Knight maybe before, but this does seem to indicate that he does exist in the MCU already and has been active for a really long time. Hopefully, we get some kind of confirmation from the crew over at Marvel Studios pretty soon. I really can't wait to see what Mahershala brings to the role. He was great in Luke Cage, quite honestly, he's been great in everything that he does, and probably the absolute perfect cast for the character. Plus, he actually reached out to Kevin Feige to play the role, and that's the kind of enthusiasm you need from an actor to bring that a performance that we've gotten from other people like Ryan Reynolds, Robert Downey Jr., and Chris Evans. So, what do you guys think? How do you feel about Mahershala Ali's comments about Wesley Snipes and filling the role of Blade? And... Do you believe Blade already existed in the MCU and he's just now rising to the surface and making himself known? Sound off in the comments below. If you like this video, make sure you press like, click subscribe, and if you don't ring that bell, you're not going to get any updates. Peace.